hey guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here guys give me a like subscribe let me know what you think of the video leave a comment because you know what why not sharing is caring share your comments with me okay so i have a highly anticipated freya's cold run so last time i done the witch casket this month i have signed up for the first time two subscription boxes i've done the witch casket unboxing already and this is the freya's cold run so this one came in plastic paper i'm gonna try not to get my address on you uh, so it came in plastic paper what i did notice witch casket by your degradable Freya's Cauldron, not biodegradable, but I'm not going to hold that against them until I see what's in the box. <laughs> so let's take a look. What we have got in the Freya's Cauldron, I nearly said the wrong one. The Freya's Cauldron um, unboxing. Oh, I'm excited, guys. This is my first Freya's Cauldron. I'm going to try not to swear, but I did get a little bit too excited in the witch's cold. I said witch casket. I meant Freya's Cauldron. Um... I got too excited in the witch casket, so I'm going to try not to with this. Now, my lovely friend Viv has told me that witch casket is more alt-right than me, and this is more for the practicing witch, so I'm really excited to open this out. By the way, shout out to Viv. Check out the lovely Akalia Luna. She's on YouTube, Instagram, Facebook, and probably many other places that I don't know about because I don't do technologies, but go and check Viv out. She's amazing. Okay, so we've got some information at the top of here. The Spellkeeper's Chest, the subscription box of the Practicing Witch, says the top there. Hello and welcome. So this is a welcome. I'm not going to read this and bore you guys with a welcome. Um, let's take a look. Recipes for Lama's Feast. Oh, lovely. Let's take a look what we've got in here. Oh, I don't want to oh, I don't want to rip anything open. Let's see what we got. So, oh, information on Lamas, which is coming up very soon. Brilliant, brilliant stuff. Information for our next Wiccan Sabbath. Amazing stuff. So, what's in this? Emerald Tumblestone. Emerald Tumblestone. Let's take a look at it. Let's take a look at it. Oh, I love me some new stones. And do you know what? I actually need emerald as well. I was actually looking at my stones the other day, thinking more of my short of. And I thought I can't find one emerald. So, in here we have a beautiful emerald stone. Look at that. How gorgeous is that? Can you see it? It's beautiful, right? So we've got a lovely, lo lovely, a lovely, a lovely emerald stone in there. There's a little, there's a little bit of paper in there, I think. No, there's not. There's just, there's no, I thought, sorry, I thought there was paper in there. So let's take a look at what we got for you. Aventrine crystal bracelet. <gasps> oh, another bracelet to go with my budded, books. I can't speak, Buddhism meditation beads. I used to be a Buddhist before I was a Wiccan, you know. Well, I did, I weren't really, but I was very interested in Buddhism and I wholly trusted everything that went along with it as well. So, oh, look at this bracelet. <gasps> look at this bracelet. See, I got a problem. I got skinny wrists, guys. No bracelets fit me. Let's see if this one passes the test. Is it going to fit my skinny wrists? And it does. And I'm going to keep that on. That is stunning. A nice little bracelet there. Oh, we've got more white watsits, guys. More white watsits. Oh, God, look at these. How cool are they? How cool are they? Spring Equinox, handmade in Thailand. Oh, guys, I need colouring pencils as well. I've got a therapeutic colouring book. Oh, I love these. Look at those, guys. <gasps> Amazing. I love that. I love that. Right then, what's this? It says at the bottom there. Be thankful for the simple things in life. That's a good That's a good motto. Be thankful for the simple things in life. So, what's... Okay. Oh, okay, cool. So, this is just like something to put bits and bobs in, like crystals and whatnot. That's cool. That's cool. That is cool. I was hoping something would be in there, but never mind. We're not to the end yet. We're not to the end yet. Oh, spell candles. Need them, need them, got them now. Chaffed. Spell candles I need. Spell candles I've got. Let's take a look at this. 
I'm loving these subscription boxes, guys. I mean, if anybody's interested in getting one of these, my fella, he's a big believer in sacrificing something to get something else that you want. So I've sacrificed getting my nails done. I do them now myself. That's why they're all different lengths. Uh, I sacrificed getting my nails done to get these subscription boxes, guys. And I really highly recommend them because it's like it's like having two Christmases a month. Today I am thankful for. I love this. Stuart is gonna love this as well. He loves positive shit like this. Amazing, amazing. So I'm gonna use my um my coloring pencils with these. Brilliant stuff. Oh, what have we got in here? I'm gonna keep that one for last. See what we got in here. So we've got some jasmine flowers. Lovely stuff. Lovely stuff. We've got jasmine flowers and we've got magical herb blend sabbat of llamas. Brilliant stuff. So I've got some herbs and stuff as well. Brilliant. And what's this? We've got candle dressing sabbat oil. So I will be using this when I do my sabbat spell. Right, now I'm intrigued, guys. What's in here? What's in here? It looks like the biggie. It looks like the biggie. What have we got? What have we got? Oh, is it an incense holder, is it? It's giving me some bubble wrap as well. I love bubble wrap. I love bubble wrap. Pop, pop, pop. Oh, Freya's cold. Oh, that's nice. It's like a little llama's plaque. I could put incense in there. I mean, I could use that for incense. I could use it for... I could fit a disc in there. I could use this for burning. Or would the wood burn, do you think? What do you think, guys? Let me know in the comment. If I put a charcoal disc in there, do you think the wood would burn? It says Freya's Cauldron in there. And it's a lovely plaque, which is going straight on my altar. I might actually start to win my llama's altar. Get it done early, out of the way. Why not? So that's what we've got, guys, in the Freya's Cauldron subscription unboxing. I love this bracelet. I love it because it fits my wrist. I've got really skinny wrists. I can never get bracelets to fit me. And this totally fits me. I mean, I'm amazed. I'm absolutely amazed. So, yeah, guys, I got some amazing things out of that. Like I said, if you want these subscription boxes, do what I done. Sacrifice something to get it done, to get to get these boxes in. Because, honestly, they're like Christmas. I waited all day yesterday for this. It was supposed to come yesterday. But it came today. Better late than never. Uh, but, yeah, that's the Freya's Cauldron July unboxing. We are in July, yeah? Right, brilliant stuff. Right, thanks for joining me, guys. I will see you soon for another video. I'm going to clear up this mess and all this uh, white dwarf sits. Bye, guys.